I love this How story. Dare you. Soul Surfer, lovely movie about Bethany Hamilton, who was this cute teen surfer chick living in Hawaii, having this perfect life. One day she goes in the water, she loses her arm to a shark. She was here last week, just a lovely girl, and Faith has played an enormous part in getting her through, and Faith plays a big part in this movie, too. Anna Sophia Robb plays Bethany. Dennis Quaid, who was so cool, plays her father. And Carrie Underwood, in her first movie role, is Bethany's youth pastor. So I talked to all of them a couple of days ago. Steve would say... You went to a junkie. I, I, well, yes, that's, that's, right, <laughs> that is what he would say. <laughs> he would also say, Dorothy's big sit down. But yes, I went to a junkie. That's okay. the shocking part. <laughs> <laughs> I want to be bad. I need your help. It's not going to be easy. I don't need easy. I just need possible. Well, the greatest surfers, they know when the best waves are coming. You feel it. You got that gift, too. I heard somebody in the other room was um, telling tales that you're, you're not the best surfer in the group. I'm sorry. No, I'm not. I'm a... Really, it was. I'd never surfed before when we started this movie, but they eventually earned the nickname "The Charger" because I was so determined. By the time we got to the scene that we we were uh, where Helen and I surfed, that I could at least be stand upright on a board for three seconds so a camera could capture me. Why did this happen? Why did I have to lose everything? You didn't lose everything, Bethany. Not even close. The aspect of faith, was that something that you were comfortable with? Did it draw you to the movie? Yeah, or? I have a very strong faith in, in, in God in, in my life. You know, I grew up with, really. And, uh, I'm thinking it and helped get it was, you I through. I thought it was, it, it was <laughs> some the thing that gets you through life, really. You know, something bigger than yourself, because you finally have to just surrender to something larger than yourself. <laughs> Shark attack. I wanted to take my son because I love the faith aspect, but he's also in the water all the time, so I was a little concerned about <laughs> the shark aspect. They, they do a good job. I mean, it, it is what it is. That's what happened. There was no way to, like, sugarcoat that. They don't, like, show the shark a lot. You know, it's not like... Um, I, I felt there's not, like... Like, you know she's bleeding, and they're like, so much blood, but you don't see it. So um, I feel like they, they did a really good job of, of telling what happened without, like, overdoing it and, like, grossing people out for the sake of grossing people out. I was surfing with B Bethany one day, and, I you know, I'm always kind of looking around. Does she? Oh, yeah. I'm All surfers do, pretty much. Yeah. But it's just one of those things where the love outweighs the fear. and Because um, I've talked to her about it. She does not seem to have fear. No, I mean, she definitely doesn't show it. I remember one time we were going out, and she goes, yeah, there was a big shark attack last week here. I don't know how I feel. But she goes out anyway, which means she's not that afraid. But she just told me, she goes, don't look down. Just don't look down. Don't you yeah. want to know? <laughs> no. Uh-uh. No. <laughs> <laughs> So yeah, Helen Hunt is a big surfer. You didn't see her that way, and, and no. Dennis had to learn. I thought Dennis would be a surfer for some reason. He's a cool dude. So the movie opens today, and uh, we'll look at the other movies opening up today in the 8 o'clock hour.